A group of London Knights traded Budweiser Gardens for the Victoria Park Bandshell this week, all for a good cause. The players who attend Blythe Academy were made captains of their teams for the second annual Broken Stick Tournament. The kids have signed up and they bought out to play and all of that money is going to Ways House, which is a foundation um, that youth, mental, uh, youth that are suffering from mental health issues can go and live there and they'll provide the support. Um, so we split all of the nights up into captains and then we had a draft yesterday at the school that lasted about an hour trying to figure it out. They took it very professionally and had a microphone and went up. It was great. Uh, and then we made a schedule and now the kids are playing. Even though it's a charitable event, that doesn't mean that some players weren't taking this seriously. 100% every shift. Uh, I, I give it 100% every shift. Um, some of the other guys I know they've been slacking off, but uh, no, I, don't, I, I just don't think that's acceptable at this, uh, at this point. Oh, Cole Timken, by far. Kid won't stop running around and uh, his hands keep moving all the time and he's taking it the most seriously. The player schedules are no doubt very busy, but all involved say it's important for them to give back to their community. But we try to do something every month to get all the school out in the community and doing something because it's part of Blythe's initiative. They want everybody out and getting involved in the community. So it's important the boys really take it on and they love doing this kind of thing. So we love it. It gets the whole school together involved in something and shows them that they can do something even as a teenager. Yeah, it's great. Uh, it's really important to raise money for the community because they do a lot for us too and it's great to help and feed them back and all that. The school is also using this as an opportunity to try and educate some of their other students on the Canadian culture of hockey. Yeah, no, it's good. I think uh, there's obviously a lot of different forms of hockey that you can play and uh, ball hockey I think is just one of those things that you grow up as a kid playing on the streets and it's always fun to get, a, get into an organized game like this or tournament like this and uh, get together and have some fun. It's great. Honestly, this is so much fun. We've, this is the second time we've done it and it's something that we look forward to every year. And it's great because we have a lot of students that are from Africa and China that have never played hockey. And so since hockey is such a big part of Canada, let alone our school, um, it's a great thing to get them out and to bond with their classmates. So it's doing really, going really well. After a very intense round robin and playoffs, it was team Bouchard and Thomas that took the title and the broken stick trophy. Reporting for Rogers TV, I'm Ryan Robinson.